Hi, let's try to do question number 3. So, let's read the question. Okay. So, a car moves with a velocity of 2 at mass negative 1. Okay. Collides with another car which has the same mass as shown in figure 1. Okay. So, um, as you can see over here, they check up. The second car is initially at rest lah. So, what happened? We have these two car. So, ni yang tidak bergerak. So, ini yang langgar dia lah. Okay, so after the collision, both cars moves at 60 and 40 degree from the horizontal, okay. So, dia cakap, car A ni bergerak di sana, okay. Uh, velocity VA, okay, berapa angle dia 60. And then, car B pula bergerak ke sana lah and then with the velocity VB, okay. So, the question one, the final velocity of each car lah. So, dia mau VA berapa, VB berapa, okay. Uh, okay, alright. So, this one, how to do this, okay. So, this one, kita buat lah. Dekat X component dulu, dekat Y component dulu lah. Because as you can see, this is a 2D collision. Uh, sebab bila kita buat macam ni kan, VA ni. So, dia automatically ada nilai uh, VA dekat X component. This one, kita ada nilai VA dekat Y component lah. Okay. Right. So, so kita buat untuk X component lah. So, kita buat summation of momentum at um, initial dengan summation of momentum kat final adalah sama. Okay. So, I write down the formula MAUA plus MBUB is equals to MAVA tukar pula V plus MBVB and then uh, denote as the X and Y component. So, this one is the X component lah kan? X kan? Uh, kalau Y, kita buat Y lah. Okay. And then, kita fill in the blank lah. Oh, tapi dia cakap um, the car A car move uh, collides with another car which has the same mass lah. Uh, jadi, bila kita tahu dia punya berat tu sama. So, kita denote dia sebagai M je lah kan. Supaya kita tak ada, kita tak ada perbezaan M, A, M, B. It's going to be M saja. Okay. So, and then we could uh, factorize this out. So, M U A X plus U B X is equals to M. V A X plus V B X and then we get rid of the M okay and then kita letaklah U A dekat X component disebabkan U A ni X so this one lah kan sebab U A kat sini dia bergerak di X component which is ke kanan so masukkanlah nilai 2 and then this one U B di X component akan jadi kosong lah sebab dia memang tak bergerak kan so tak bergerak dekat X kosong dekat Y pun kosong lah so this one will be 0 Okay, what is the value of your VAX? Okay, so VAX is over here. So, VAX is actually positive VA um, cos, I think VA cos 60, isn't it? Okay, so masukkan VAX tu sebagai uh, VA cos 60 plus, uh, how about your VBX? Okay, so this one, want to find the value of VBX. Okay, and then this one is the VBX. So, VBX pula, this is our VB. So, your VBX will be somewhere over here lah. So, this one is our VBX. So, dia akan jadi positif. VB cos 40 lah. Okay. Uh, cos 40. Okay. So, this one would be VB cos 40. Okay. So, this is the value. Okay. So, okay. VB cost 40. Okay. And then, uh, I don't have my calculator with me. Nanti kamu, kalau boleh kamu tahu, tulis lah terus cost, uh, apa tu. Cost 60 tu berapa nilai dia. Cost 40 tu berapa nilai dia. Okay. Uh, so, this one is denote as, um, this one akan jadi 2 je lah kan. 2 sama dengan, nanti kamu tulis lah eh, berapa nombor dia. Cos 60 ni berapa and then cos 40 ni berapa kan. Eh? Mesti ada calculator pula sekarang. Okay, that is 1. Okay, so as you can see lah, we have two unknowns kan. We have VA dengan VB. So, uh, you punya idea adalah uh, kita akan buat simultaneous equation lah kan. Untuk dapatkan VA dengan VB sebab kita ada dua unknown. Okay, uh, jadi kita akan buat for the Y component. Okay. So, Y component would be um, summation of momentum initial sama dengan summation of momentum final. This one would be MAUA plus MBUB is equals to 
Oh, lupa pula eh. Kita M tu, mass tu tiada simbol. Okay. MVA plus MVB. Okay. So, this is at Y component. So, I'm going to denote at Y, 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 Y. So, mass ni boleh factorize keluar. So, this one mass. Okay. Goes to mass. V A Y plus V B Y. Okay. And then we know that this one U A Y. Okay. Sebab kalau objek ni hanya bergerak ke A ni. Hanya bergerak di S komponen. Jadi U A Y ni dia tak gerak ke Y lah. Okay. And then for the car B dia memang tak bergerak langsung. So obviously dekat Y dia pun kosong lah. So ni kosong. So how about your nilai V A Y. So V A Y. Okay V A Y yang mana. Uh, VAY, okay, this one kan VAY, okay. Because this is our VA, and ni kita punya VAY. So, VAY, I think will be positive. Um, VA, um, sine 60, isn't it? Right? So, sine 60, so I put the value. VA sine 60, okay. So, that is for the VAY. Okay, untuk V, B, Y pula. V, B, Y. Okay, so V, B, Y adalah. So, this one is our V, B. Jadi, V, B, Y mestilah di sini kan. So, V, B, V, B, Y is equals to negative sebab ke bawah. Uh, v, B. Uh, sin 40 isn't it ok so masukkanlah dalam you punya equation uh, will be negative um, negative VB sin 40 okay. ok so this one is for VBY ok So, and then you have the second equation. Okay. So, again, nanti kamu tekanlah berapa nilai sin 60, berapa nilai sin 40 lah. Okay. And then, uh, nanti kamu selesaikanlah si Martinis equation dia tu berapa. And then, you should get your VA to be um, 1.31 ms negative 1. And then, your VB would be 1.76 ms negative 1. Okay. Okay, let's try to do question number 4. So, let's read the question. Okay. So, two balls A and B. So, we have A and B. Each with velocity of 25 cm as negative 1. And 15 cm as negative 1. Okay. So, this one lah. Are moving in the opposite direction. Okay. So, as you can imagine. Mereka ni berlanggar macam ni. Okay. Lepas tu. What happened? The balls collide with each other and bounce off. Okay. Uh, the mass of ball A and B are 20 gram and 25 gram respectively lah. So, calculate the final velocity of the ball B and its direction if the final velocity of ball A is 10 cm as negative 1 as shown in the figure 2. Okay. So, what happened here is that the A and B berlanggar dengan velocity masing-masing. Lepas tu, what happened? Uh, mereka pun ber bergerak macam ni kan. Okay, bergerak macam tu and then dia kasih kita value of VA and then dia punya angle but the question one the value of VB. Okay, and then Uh, so, kita tahulah kita akan cari berapa nilai VB kita and then the angle lah. Okay, jadi uh, the key, this one is a vector kan. Uh, jadi, you have to find the value of VB X component and then also VB at Y component. Okay, so kita akan buat satu-satu lah. Okay, kita akan buat dulu um, uh, at X component pula eh. Okay, X component. Summation of momentum initial sama dengan summation of momentum final. Okay. At, at X component. Okay. So, I'm going to denote as X here. X here. X here. And then, kita tulislah. M A U A plus M B U B plus. Eh, sorry. Equals to M A V A. Plus MB, VB. And then I put the X punya sign. Okay. Okay. And then we know that the value of mass A is um 20 gram. And then the value of mass B is 25 gram. Okay. 
So maksudnya this one is um, mass A is a uh, 0.02 isn't it? Okay, tak, eh? Mass A is 0.02 kilogram. So from gram convert to kilogram and mass B is um 0.025 uh, kilogram. Okay, so put it here. And then we know that UAX is um tengok UA dekat X component kan dia bergerak. So it's 25. Okay, tapi dia ada centimeter as negative 1. So SI unit untuk uh, velocity adalah MS negative 1. So kita buang centi tu dengan menukarkan dia kepada nombor iaitu 25 times 10 of centi is negative 2. MS negative 1 lah. Okay, so this one maksudnya adalah 25 darab sebuah kuasa negative 2 MS negative 1. Okay. This one is 15 darab sepuluh kuasa negative 2 ms negative 1. Okay. So this one plus dengan. Okay. Plus mass B is 0.025. And then we have the UB. Dia bergerak di X komponen lah. Okay X komponen. But in opposite direction. So it will be negative lah. So this one will be negative. 15 times 10 of negative 2. Okay. Then I have to make this smaller. Tukar tepi lagi kan. Okay. Uh, resize. So maybe I'll make it smaller. Okay. Okay. And then equals to our mass A is um 0 0.02. Okay. VAX. So di mana kita punya VAX. Okay. So tengok kat sini. So this is our VA. So, maksudnya our VAX is over here lah. VAX is actually negative sebab ke kiri. Uh, 10 darab 10 kuasa negative 2. So, this one would be sine or cos. So, I think this one, I think would be cos lah kan. Cos 35. And then, ya yeah, kamu pun tulis lah kat situ eh. Okay. I don't have my calculator with me. So, you have to press the calculator to tahu berapa nilai cos 35 eh. Negative 2 cos cos 35. Okay. Okay, I'm so sorry. Banyak pula kesalahan di sini. Okay. Can together. Okay, and then tak cukup tempat sikit lah. And then, dah buat yang ni. So, this one is this one. Okay, this one eh. Okay. Then, I'm going to do this one. Okay, which is. Uh, mass B is um 0.025. And then, I don't know the value of VBX, betul? Because, Miss Mo cari juga VBX tu berapa, kan? VBX tu berapa, okay? So, if you solve all of these, okay, using calculator. So, you get your VBX to be, um, I think, 0 0.116 MS negative 1. Okay. So, sudah obtain VBX lah. So, our next aim is to obtain the VBY. Okay. So, VBY kena cari lah before we find the VB. Okay. So, that is for the X component. So, I'm going to do for the Y component. So, summation of momentum initial sama dengan summation of momentum final. So, M A U A plus M B U B equals to M A V A uh, plus M B V B but this one is for the Y component so this is Y Y Y Y lah okay so this one uh, okay uh, from before the collision, okay, we can see that pergerakannya hanya melibat the X component kan. Dia tidak bergerak atas ataupun bawah. So, we say that this one velocity dekat U, A ni tapi dekat Y adalah, dia bergerak kat X saja kan. Jadi, this one will be zero. Sama juga. Uh, untuk this one, B dia hanya bergerak di X component saja. Jadi, nilai U, B, Y adalah kosong. Okay, so this one will be zero lah. Completely zero. Okay. So, and then I insert this one, okay. This one, I'm going to insert it to be um, 0 0.02. Okay, VAY, how to find our VAY. So, this is our VA. Uh, jadi, VAY kita mesti di sini lah, okay. So, this is our VA. 
ay which is um, positif 10 darab sur kuasa negatif 2 sebab miss nak buang senti ni uh, sin 35 okay and then you copy that and then you put it here okay which is 10 darab 10 kuasa negatif 2 sin 35 okay so that is for uh, that one okay and then I'm going to do for that one I'm going to find the value of VBY plus MB is 0 0.025 so I want the VBY so that I get this value over here okay so kalau kamu tekan calculator your VBY would be um, negative 0 0.04 for 6 m as negative 1 okay so this one is negative value so as you can imagine lah uh, kamu check, double check balik kan vbx you obtain a positive value which is betul lah dia ke kanan and then you punya vby negative jadi dia ke bawah lah so dia tally lah okay so what how to find the value of vbx so we are going to use um theorem Pythagoras set to vb okay is equals to VBX square plus VBY square. Okay. So insert the value 0 0.116 square plus negative 0 0.046 square. Square root answer. And then I think you get your answer to be 0 0.125 MS negative 1. Okay. So disebabkan dia adalah sejenis vector. So we have to find the direction iaitu dia punya angle ok so the direction would be tangent tangent theta ok so apa-apa yang dekat y komponen iaitu vby bahagi dengan vbx lah so in case siapa yang tak faham lagi kan kenapa kita guna y ok because this is the angle ok so this one x is 0 0.116 y is negative uh, 0 0.046 lah so i'm using towa over here eh towa is tangent theta equals to opposite over adjacent because um our opposite is the y component okay and then our adjacent is the uh, adjacent is our x component okay so that's why lah miss boy that one lah so that's why dia akan jadi negative Zero point, okay, kena tak modular supaya jawapan angle tu setiasa positif. Bagi uh, zero point one one six, and I think you get your angle to be um twenty one point six degree, okay.